up everybody and welcome back to Blue Jays Today, where today we've got some interesting Blue Jays trade updates. There's some rumors speculating on the internet that the Blue Jays might make a trade very, very soon and here are the details. So if you haven't heard, the Blue Jays are at the 40-man roster limit and that is without Chris Bassett. So in order to add Chris Bassett officially to the roster, they're going to have to make some moves. They're going to have to cut somebody on the fringe of the 40-man roster or they might make a trade like they did with the Steven Matz back in the day. Now, if you're going to cut someone, you probably want to cut someone like an Anthony Kay, a Thomas Hatch, or maybe a Trent Thornton. Guys that are getting up there in age, getting up there in price tags, and are not really hitting their potential. Or, instead of cutting them, if you could find a suitable trade partner, that would be more ideal. And that's what it appears the Blue Jays are looking for right now. And speaking of Steven Matz, a potential suitor for the Toronto Blue Jays would be a New York Mets. They are rumored that they want to trade a Carlos Carrasco off their team, and they've got some space on their 40-man roster. They're currently at 39. If they maybe want to package a couple guys together for a Carlos Carrasco, who only has one year left on his contract for $14 million, and he's got some upside to be a very good starting pitcher, and the Blue Jays, instead of maybe going out and buying one more guy or making a, a big trade with one of their catchers, this might be a good fifth guy in that rotation for the Blue Jays to go out and get. So guys, let me know in the comments down below, what do you think is going to happen? Are the Blue Jays going to cut someone? Are they going to trade someone? And what would be a good trade suitor for the Blue Jays that aren't the New York Mets? Keep your eyes peeled to Twitter, folks, because we've got some news coming up soon, hopefully. And as always, guys, go Jays go.